The Durbar has a long history. What first started as a display of military might, and a show of fealty by the subjects of the Shaki has today evolved into a social display of tradition, culture, skill aesthetics and grandeur. Most of the emirates, states and kingdoms that existed along the northern part of the West African sub-region in the pre-colonial period were entirely dependent on the cavalry for their military campaigns. Consequently, the grooming of horses by the royal families, court officials and other state officials was necessary. While the Shaki retained horses for the military campaigns, it was also necessary that other officials keep horses to assist them in the dispensation of their state functions. The Durbar has come to assume the status of an international carnival, with visitors coming to witness it both locally and internationally. Therefore, there is no doubt that if efficiently and skillfully managed and presented, the Durbar can become a source of driving tourism for Kwara and Nigeria at large.